but still the headbangs and the jumping performances are stunning. How is it possible? Does Kaminaga-san do some kind of special training? Then let's start playing. So, if you don't cut the phrases at the right places, they will sound completely different. In part 1, we asked Kamina-san questions about the Chakuhachi and himself, and lastly played a Chakuhachi duet together. In this video, we will ask him more questions about Wagaki Band, and how he sees his future as a Chakuhachi player. Especially the question I asked him about how he always does such an amazing performance on stage was interesting, so I hope you can look forward to it. At the end of the video, I'll be performing another song with Kamina-san this time with the Koto performer too. I'll be receiving feedback about my performance, so this will be a very educational video for all musicians too. Then, let's get started. First of all, I wanted to ask Kamina-san about his performance style in Wagaki Band, where he does headbangs and jumps as he plays the shakuhachi. Does he have someone that he tried to mimic, or was it something he came up with originally? Wagaki Band, あの、さんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさんさ
He said he's willing to study foreign languages that he can perform overseas more often. If you'd like to invite Kamina san, please contact him through his social media. Then finally, we'll like to perform one more song together. <laughs> Just like Asamoya we played in part 1, Hoshinagame is also a song that Kaminaga-san composed. But what's different is that there is a koto harp part to this song. So we invited a koto player to perform together with us. Kaminaga-san often invites Sugimoto-san to his live concerts, and they have been on stage together many times. It's a really big pleasure to have her with us too. Then, let's start playing!
Everyone, thank you so much for listening. I hope you can forgive me for my mistakes. Chogo san no gassou lyuk ga takai desu ne. A no, aite no oto mo chan to kiite awaseru te, jitsu wa kantan no yude nakanaka dekiir koto de wa nai no de, o koto to hajimete te koto de shita kedo, hai, sugoku ii gassou datta na to, hai, arigato mashita. Kaminaga san is way too kind. From here, I will have Kaminaga-san give me advice about how to get better at the shakuhachi. He told me there are three things that I especially need to be careful about. Let's start with the first one. この星長めという曲、あのまあ江戸時代のその三曲合奏という音楽、おことと三味線と尺八で合わせる音楽のイメージで僕が作った新しい曲なんですね。すね the structure of 星長め is very similar to traditional music in how it has singing at the beginning and the end, has an instrumental part in the middle, etc. Kaminaga-san wanted this song to be a practice song before shakuhachi practitioners actually start practicing the difficult traditional songs. However, because this song is based on music from the Edo period, you must cover some important things. So, because these kinds of songs are meant to be played together with string instruments, the shakuhachi must be played in a special way to blend the music well. However, learning about this is not easy. で、そういったものがを演奏するときに、登山流では楽譜上はこの今見ていただいている楽譜でもハーヒーハーローしか書いてないんですけれど、実際にはハからヒに行くときに。ちょっと装飾を入れます。はあ、ひはひ。The grace notes and special methods are not written anywhere on the score. You must learn these things from your instructor. And as you practice more songs, you eventually will be able to know when to do what. So the first piece of advice was that I should focus on the unique playing techniques of the music from the Edo period. The next was the second piece of advice. この独特な音楽なので、日本のその江戸時代の音楽ってリズムとハーモニーが存在しないんですよ。メロディーしか。はい。メロディーの流れでフレーズを捉えることが大事なので。Let's pick up one phrase from this song. くびれ目がどこかっていうと、実はレーツロロ。はあ、ひーはろーろーっていう、ここにあるんですよね。これは普通に吹いてると、どうしても。はい、やってましたよね。はい、やりたくなっちゃうんですけれど、さっき言ったように、これは。っていうフレーズと。っていうフレーズの二つに分解できるんですね。did you understand how the two ways of playing work different。just like ブルマシュワーツ and traditional dancing。there are kata。Fixed phrases inside Japanese music too. So if you don't cut the phrases at the right places, they will sound completely different. <laughs> Through training in playing traditional pieces, you need to understand the blocks of sounds and how the phrases work. Then there is one final piece of advice from Kaminaga-san. 先ほどそのリズムとハーモニーがないって言ったんですけれど、はい、グルーブはすごくあるんですね,ですねこの音楽っていうのはもともと琴や三味線の音楽で尺八が入るようになったのは明治時代に入ってから先ほども説明した通りですけれどなのであの琴や三味線のノリを知ることが大事で。As Kaminaga-san explained about the history of the shakuhachi, the bamboo flute finally became a musical instrument from a religious tool after the samurai society ended. It was added afterwards to the music that was originally created for just the koto and shamisen. So shakuhachi players must fully understand how the string instruments work and try to match their sounds. For example, both the koto and shamisen are played by plucking up and down or back and forth, and it gives a unique groove. Hi, hi, hi. Hi, hi, hi. So this one. The shakuhachi is a flute, so it can't make such a groove. But it's important that the player understands this in their mind. では、あの今後ますます精進していきたいと思います。はい。はい、また引き続きよろしくお願いします。よろしくお願いします。ありがとうございました。改めましてありがとうございます。神永さん、杉本さん、and everyone watching this video, thank you very much. Please check out the description box to learn more about Kaminaga-san and the activities that I'm doing. I'll see you in my next video. 皆さんどうもありがとうございました。